I got a vision I see in my head, a melody buried deep into my soul. They call us crazy, we cutting the edge, unlocking the future and letting it go. This is a calling that's higher the time we decided our stories are gonna be told. This is where legends are born, we paving the road, a future that favors the bold. Break the rules, break the laws, this is the moment we change it all. Break the rules, break the laws, this is the moment we change it all. Yeah, greatness, yeah, it feels like greatness. Woo! We came here to shatter the mold yeah. I know you hear it, I know you see yeah. it We are the fearless, we are the genius yeah. We are defiance, we are the beacons yeah. We are the true yeah. believers Yeah, greatness Yeah, it feels like greatness Woo. Greatness Yeah, it feels like greatness Legendary in the making Reach out and we take it Not to emerge, we on the verge And it feels like greatness
is cooking. Welcome to the WWE Western Talk Show with me, Slot Jones and Sean Rand Smith was bringing you our pre show for this uh, this Saturday's Elimination Chamber. Coming at you from the Bell Centre in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. Yes, get ready for the Montreal screw job again. <laughs> Hopefully not. But yes, we Road to WrestleMania goes through the Elimination Chamber. And as we get ever closer to WrestleMania, we have several matches that will probably paint a picture of uh, what the Elimination Chamber will look like, uh, what WrestleMania will look like. We have an elimination chamber match for the United States Championship. Yes, well, before we, yes, well, normally when it comes to the elimination chamber matches, what we tend to see is one champion, world championship contender, of course, is decided in the Royal Rumble match. The other tends to be uh, decided in the Elimination Chamber. However, due to the fact that uh, currently the WWE and Universal Championship are considered one title, undisputed, that will not take place. But, as just mentioned, the United States Championship will be defended inside the Elimination Chamber. As Austin Theory will defend his United States Championship against Seth Freakin' Collins, Johnny Gagano, Bronson Reed, Damian Priest, and Montez Ford. Now, after the very winning this match, I automatically rule out Montez Ford. Same here. Damian, P- Damian Priest. Although a uh, former United States champion has something going with a ju- less of a judgment day. Yes. Bronson Reed is too new to the main roster. So not yet. I wouldn't say no to Johnny Gargano. Me would I, to be honest. But then I would say it's probably the favourite to win is either Seth Rollins or Austin Theory. Yes, and, I would say that as well. And judging by, the, judging by the reported rumours that 
Austin Theory's uh, WrestleMania opponent will be John Cena. If they want to make that a United States Championship match, they can. However, if that is a United States Championship match, I think it gives away who's winning. It pretty much does, doesn't it? Now, speaking of uh, championship contenders and Royal Rumble match winners, we have another one. After becoming only the fourth person to uh, win the Royal Rumble match from entry number one, yeah, Rhea Ripley decided she wanted revenge after what happened at Corona Mania. Yes. And is and has decided to challenge Charlotte for the SmackDown Women's Championship at WrestleMania. Uh not the match we were not the match we were wanting, but hey ho, it's the way how it goes. Uh, it's over. So Adam Pierce set up an elimination chamber match where the winner would challenge Becky uh, Bianca Belair. Of a Raw Women's Championship at WrestleMania. Four of the superstars were decided by the final four eliminated in the Women's Rumble match. The other two were decided in qualifying matches. And the four women who were given automatic buys in this match were Liv Morgan, Asuka. Nikki Cross and Raquel Rodriguez. Leaving two qualifying matches for the following two women. Which were won by Natalia and Carmella. Yeah, you heard us back. Carmella has officially come back after her concussion that she suffered. Now you will also notice here that this is a situation where we have three Raw women and three SmackDown women. Yes, unpredictable this one. And you, you might be wondering why. Well, technically, Rhea Ripley is a on the Raw roster, but she's challenging for the SmackDown Championship. Again, again, we go off something that happened that. The Royal Rumble as the Royal Rumble went off the air. Yeah. Zami Zayn may have made the worst mistake of his career at the Royal Rumble. Yes. When after Roman Reigns had successfully defended against Kevin Owens, Zayn, Man- Zayn uh, hit uh, Lanes in the back of a chair, Seth Rollins style. However, Zayn would ultimately be beaten down because of it. Yes. However, one thing that Sami Zayn did manage to do, or at least appeared to have done, is divide the bloodline. Yes. With Jay Uso walking away. It was very surprising, to be honest. So then we uh, come up to the next episode of SmackDown. Zami Zayn challenges Roman Reigns to a undisputed Universal Championship match. Yes. Which Roman Reigns accepts. And let's just say he says because Zami Zayn te- tore his family apart, Lynch will do the same in front of Zami Zayn's family because, of course, Zami Zayn is from Now, back at Extreme Rules, 
The Judgment Day decided it would be a very good idea to deliver the concerto to Beth Phoenix. So then Edge, of course, shows back up in the Men's Royal Rumble match. Eliminates Priest and Barra from the match. Because they then uh, retaliate by eliminating Edge. They go off, they brawl a bit, and Leo Ripley gets involved, which then brings out Beth Phoenix. And despite Leo Ripley having a championship match at uh, WrestleMania, she now has a rated daddy tour. Yeah, she does. So good luck to Rhea Ripley and Finn Balor this Saturday. As as in a mixed tag team match, Edge and Beth Phoenix will take on the team of Finn Balor and Leo Ripley. But don't forget, Judgment Day will have the factor of Damian Priest and Rhea Ripley's. Well, well, we say that Judgment Day will have Damian Priest. It depends whether this match happens before or after the United States Championship Elimination Chamber match. It does. That's very true. And then the final match on the card involves the storyline which has been on and off for the better part of a year. Which is Bobby Lashley versus... Brock Lesnar. Oh, Jesus. The whole thing really started at day one last year when Brock Lesnar was added to the WWE Championship match after Roman Reigns' farewell. <laughs> then kind of then continued into last year's Elimination Chamber, which took place from Saudi Arabia. Except uh, Bobby Lashley was removed from that match due to a so-called concussion and uh, lost to the WWE Championship. Then Roman Reigns went on to have a WrestleMania and SummerSlam match with uh, well, my name's Brock Lesnar went on to have a WrestleMania and SummerSlam match with uh, Roman Reigns. Yes. And then they uh, he took this back up going into uh, Saudi Arabia's Crown Jewel when Brock Lesnar decided to cost Lashley the United States Championship. And then after that match at Crown Jewel, Rotsley decided to attempt to uh, take Lesnar out by keeping the Kamal lock on him. Doing further damage to Rotsley's arm. And then, of course, the situation that happened with the Royal Rumble match this year. Yes. We're actually close lining Lesnar over the top row. Now, considering the fact that the last one-on-one match that these two had, Lesnar won, and in less than a WWE's typical 50-50 booking, I would not at all be surprised if Lashley wins this one, and then we have, and then we have a third and deciding match take place at WrestleMania. So those are the five matches currently confirmed for Elimination Chamber. Possibility we may have a sixth one added, but uh, I wouldn't be surprised if that's all we have. In an Elimination Chamber match for the United States Championship, Austin Fury defends against Seth Rickin Lawrence, Johnny Gargano, Bronson Reed, Damian Priest, and Montez Ford. And in the second Elimination Chamber match, the 
decide who goes on to WrestleMania to face the Young Bella in the Raw Women's Championship. Asuka will take on Liv Morgan, Nikki Cross, Carl Gonzalez, and uh, Slash Rodriguez, Natalia, and Carmella. Head of the table, Roman Reigns defends the Undisputed Universal Championship against the former Arnelli Us, Zami Zayn. In a mixed tag team match, the Glamazon Beckys and the Radar Superstar Edge will take on Finn Balor and Rhea Ripley on the Judgment Day. And Bobby Lashley goes one on one with the alpha male of our species, the beast incarnate, Mark Lesnar. The Elimination Chamber will take place this Saturday night on the 18th of February from the uh, Bell Centre in Montreal, Quebec, Canada. So that about does it for our pre-show of the Elimination Chamber, was known as No Escape in Germany. Join us next week where we will bring you the results and any uh, other WrestleMania after effects that may be taking place. So until then, he's been... Lisa Lock-Jones, and he's been... John Randy Smith, and we will see you next week for our reactions to Elimination Chamber.